What's up guys, Sinewee Icon473 here, bringing you another YouTube video. I am very, very, very excited today. I am here with Pokemon Shield. The first Pokemon playthrough I've ever done on my channel. And, yeah, I'm really excited. It's the first home console Pokemon game properly. Let's go Pikachu is a remake. And I'll be playing through Shield version. Uh, I was debating with which version to pick. Uh, I said I'd pick Shield, also I am the whitest of boys. Um, I said I picked Shield just because that seems to be like the least popular one out of the two. I didn't want to be like the normie guy. I don't know, I want to try and pick like the rare of the two on YouTube. Um, I'm going to go by my real name, Rory. Uh, I can't change languages, I don't give a fuck, son. Um, if you're finding my channel through Pokemon, how? Why? Uh, I've never uploaded Pokemon before. I'm not a PG channel, I swear a lot. I'm going to try and monetize this video. Because I have a bank account now. What the fuck? It's a YouTube channel. This is so meta. I've seen a lot of people complaining about the performance of this online. It looks pretty clean to me. Welcome one and all. Bad guy. With a mustache like that. He's a bad guy. Our beloved Gala region is a wonderful place with thriving nature. Yeah, we know, pal. Beautiful cities and many Pokemon with which we share our lives. As you know, our society is able to thrive. I like that Pokemon, by the way. Um, I can't fucking remember what it's called, though. I know its evolution is called Copperaja. It's a steel type. I, did, I looked at the leaks, by the way, beforehand, because I don't have the ability to contain my excitement. Yeah, a lot of people have been talking shit about this game. I'm still excited. A lot of it is valid criticism, but at the end of the day, more Pokemon. So just get in me. I don't care. A bad Pokemon game, still a good video game to me. Rose. Why, oh, he's such a bad guy. Undefeated champion, Leon. I heard you can skip the tutorial in this. I'm very excited for that. Oh man, look at this man. He's so saucy. He's just like, look at me. I'm Leon. And it's fucking Charizard. And that's Duraludon, I think it's called. It's so weird to not have voice acting, to be honest. Like, I don't know, man. I, I, fuck, I feel like there should be voice acting. Dynamax Charizard. Except that's Gigantamax, not Dynamax. And oh my god. Okay, that does look sick. That does look sick, actually. I'm not going to lie. That's really cool. I love Dynamax from the first trailer. I was like, oh my god, this is class. Wooloo, going on my team. Don't give a fuck. Proud cheap farmer. Get in my team right now. That's me. No, it's not. It's hot. Never mind. <sighs> I'm excited. Reddit ain't gonna bring me down. Munchlax. Love you, bro. That's me. I'm playing my Switch. Am I? Or is it my phone? It's probably a Switch. I love how, like, so battling in this region is, like, part of the culture, which I love. That my new flash, that my flash new phone, Rory. You can't cheer mom with your hands full. His famous Charizard pose. Oh, look at my ma. She's wearing Wellington boots. This is so English. See, like, Irish people won't admit this, but a lot of English and Irish culture is similar. Like, some of our slang would have overlap. Uh, some of our, like, our clothing styles is fucking same, really. Um, and the whole, like, the locales look very similar. So, like, the countryside, the forests. Like, I've been in England and I've been in Wales. And a lot of it does kind of look similar to Ireland. Just a bit more. You know, mountains are higher, fields are bigger, etc. But it's kind of similar. So, I didn't hop say I should bring my bag and in my room. And don't forget to grab my hat. Ah, oh, how, how do? I'm in confusion. What on earth? Oh, there's my room. Okay. My dad's old bag. A mention of my dad in a Pokemon game? 
Also, I'm wearing a beanie. Finally. I've had two generations of shit hats. <laughs> fucking X and Y had the flat peaky caps and then um, fucking Pokemon Sun had the bucket hats. Yeah, I like how battling is part of this game's culture, you know? Like in Alola, it was all about the trials. It was all about like the islands and nature and stuff. Whereas this is about like, like battling is a spectator sport. That old bag looks like it could pull you over. Huh, <laughs> that's true. Huh, <laughs> you dumb fuck. A wooloo. Ha <laughs> ha, you... That's so funny. I love that, actually. Slumbering weld. I'm assuming it's weld and not wield. Right. Let's go, you fucking prick. I love if a Wooloo just fucking rolls after him. That's class. Town map. I love how town map's on a hood. That's and Rotom. Wedgehurst? Route 2. Meetup spot. Dapple Grove. Modestoke. This is all the wild area, isn't it? You can toggle the weather? This is wild area here. How do I zoom? Wait, do I have to actually catch Hop? Oh, look at that. R classic Pokemon. It's hardly another town over there, is it? Um, this is probably Hop's house. Yeah. Mum. <laughs> we don't say mum, we say ma. How the fuck could his brother get lost? Maybe he's never... Yeah, they probably just moved here. I like Hop so far. I don't mind the friendly arrivals, to be honest. A rival doesn't necessarily need to be an antagonist. I'd like for them to have some agency of their own. So, like, I loved how because he had his own... Mo like, he was a fucking dumbass, but, like, he had his own motivation. So, yeah, Wedgehurst, Route 2. Meetup spot. I'm assuming that's the wild area. That's, um, the, like, the big city. I see, are these branching paths? Galar Mine and Galar Mine 2. Hilbury, is it? Or Hulbury? Hulbury, Turfield... Hammerlock. Love that name. Spikemouth. These are so English. Stow on side. Oh my god. Glimwood Tangle. Ballinley. Why is this so ink? This is actually really accurate. Churchester. Oh man, I love it. I love it so much. Route 10. Ballin oh, I already looked at that. Ballinley. Winden. That's like London. Oh, and then that's the fucking Pokemon League, I guess. Hmm. I have heard this Pokemon game is quite short, but um, I don't really give a fuck. This, on this playthrough, I'm not going to be doing a lot of faffing. Like, I'm doing a personal playthrough off camera on my new Switch Lite that I got. Um, oh, wait. So he has his partner, Wooloo, and I have to steer clear of the tall grass. So, um, what was I going to say? Basically... Um, I'll be doing my own playthrough on that, and I'll be doing all my 100% completion Pokedexy stuff on this playthrough. I'm just doing, you know, the story, and I'm gonna try, I'm gonna try and catch all the new Galar Pokemon. His logo on his chest is a sword and a shield.
if I'm skipping through the text too fast, I'm sorry, I read quite quick. Um, he's not really saying anything important. He wants Galar's trainers to be the strongest in the world. Look at his little bro. Exactly an inch and a quarter. See, I love that in this game the champion is like a very important part of your journey. Because it hasn't been that way for a long time. Like, in Sun and Moon, obviously, the, the plot twist that Kukui is like the final boss fight was amazing. Loved it. And it was so well done. But you didn't know he was a champion. Well, there wasn't a champion. You were battling him to crown the first one. And then in X and Y, Diantha is the worst champion. In Black and White 2, Iris doesn't really do a lot. Um, Alder's pretty cool, but with last time we had a baller champion that was actually involved in your journey and gave you advice was Cynthia. So I like that they're making a champion the focal point of the story. My boy Grookey! Spoilers, I'm picking Grookey by the way. Um, I really like Sobble. I'll probably use him for my um, solo playthrough. It depends on whoever my girlfriend's gonna pick. If my girlfriend picks Sobble, I'm gonna pick uh, Scorbunny just because I wanna try. If I'm doing Pokedex stuff, it's handier. Then I'll just pick both of them. I don't. I've seen the revolutions and I don't hate any of them. I think it's probably the most consistent trio we've had since like Gen 4, in that there's none in it that I dislike. Because I'm not a fan of Embor, Delphox, and Primarina. Like, they're okay. Like,. Um, Grookey, clear standout, Grookey's a legend. Uh, when I first saw Sable's evolution, I was like, what the fuck, they massacred my boy. But, um, it's alright, it's grown on me. Same with, uh, Scorbunny's evolution. Which will I choose? If you see me looking off to my, uh, right, it's just to make sure my game hasn't fucking shat itself. I swear a lot. I, in my head, I was like, oh, I'm not gonna fucking, I'm not gonna swear too much because, like, kids might watch this. But, no, I don't care. It's soothing. Like a nice long walk in the woods. I like. I remember in Gen 1 they said like a different line of dialogue for whoever you picked. Scorpion's fire type, filled to bursting with fiery passion. Honestly, like, I love Sobble because he is a mood. Like, he is very relatable. It adapts to anything. I really do like Sobble, but um, I'm going to be rolling with my boy Grookey because there's a Pokemon that I want to use in my sword playthrough called Flapple, and he's a grass type, so. Alright, I'm going to pick on my boy Grookey and we go bounce. I won't be nicknaming my Pokemon. Um, if I do a Nuzlocke of this game, which I probably will in a few months' time, I will then do it. I want to see if this game is even Nuzlockable. I've heard it's really easy. So, he picks. I don't like that the rival always picks the one weaker than yours. I just. That doesn't sit right with me. Oh my god, Wooloo's fucking huge! See. Even if the story is lackluster, right? I am already much more invested than I was in X and Y because I have a tangible goal, for want of a better word. Like, I know, yeah, do the island challenge or become champion or whatever, but the fact that Leon is a character and he's like, I want you guys to get stronger to fight me. I want to see what you're made of. I don't know, I just feel much more motivated now. Also, I, I think this game takes less time getting into its shit than fucking Sun and Moon does. I have made fast friends with Grookey. I'm gonna get myself a Grookey hoodie for Christmas. He Like, I'm in love with this Pokemon. Every generation, uh, with the exception of Gen 2 where I picked Toadog first, I've always, always picked the Grass Starter first. It's not necessarily my favourite out of every region, because sometimes my opinion has changed over time, but... Out of the eight starters, Grass is my undisputed favourite for four of those generations. Three, four, 
seven and no eight. And then in in no generation, it's my least favorite. So also I spat the hop. I'm going to do like starter tier lists and stuff soon on YouTube. I'm going to start bringing in more Pokemon content. I hope. Now this is Pokemon, so I'm not getting my hopes too high for the story. But there's some interesting stuff here with Hop's arc. You know. He has two Pokemon already. What? Oh. I was wondering if it was level 3. <laughs> Fucking noob. If a starter is not level 5, I'll be salty. I love the um, UI as well. It looks so clean. Because I was wondering how it was going to look on one screen. Would it be cluttered? But um, so far it's looking pretty saucy. I'm not going to lie. Because obviously this is the first Pokemon game. Well... No, um, like, let, I always forget about Let's Go Pikachu. Like, I really like the art style of that game. I would have been happy if that was the Gen 8 art style. Like, this obviously looks a lot better. That's what I leveled up. Um, Branch Poke. Okay. Like, this obviously looks a lot better. But, um, you know, like, I wouldn't have minded if that was as good as it got. Because it's not about Pokemon graphics to me. Like, I really couldn't care less. You know? Whoa! Get wrecked. Did you already know about type advantages? Yes. I love how, like... I low-key love that when you do something right in the tutorial, it's like... Oh, you already knew about that. That's class, man. That's so cool. I've heard that, like, if you catch Pokemon before the Pokemon catching tutorial, it'll skip it. Which... Oh my god! Yes, me and that Grookey are too much. Grookey gang, let's go. No, but, but regards to difficulty, I really don't care. Be a real rival to Hop, would you? Um, join the gym challenge. Not put. Yeah, I love how in this, like, they have to let you do the gym challenge. I'm I'm liking this so far. It's making a good first impression on me. Like, so does every Pokemon game, but... I don't need an amazing story. I don't need it to be really difficult. I just need it to not treat me like an idiot. And be somewhat engaging. I don't mind if Pokemon game has no story. Uh, Gen 1 has no story. Gen 2 has fuck all story. Um, but, um... I don't like when the story treats you like an idiot. Like, X and Y story is offensively bad. We have to go and save this Wooloo as well. Slumbering Weld. Yo, this looks whack. The music is clean as well. This The music sounds very, like, Pokemon movie-ish. Squovit. Squovit. <laughs> I actually like this dude. I'm not going to use it. Fuck that. But, um... Do I have Pokeballs? No. Okay. Right. Get knocked out, son. Also, the camera looks pretty clean as well. Yeah, no. He, I knew he'd be the early route rodent. But, um... His evolution's okay. Most early route rodents I don't like, with the exception of like Ferret and Linoon. And even then I wouldn't use them, I just like them. Linoon's in this game. I wouldn't mind using um What the fuck's it called? Obstagoon. I wouldn't mind. Um Cause I don't really know if I'm using any gallery forms yet. I uh, see fucking everyone on their ma is using Corviknight. But that's because he's really cool. I might I might have to The ba trainer battle team in this is class too. Pokemon soundtrack is always good. Like I've never been let down. Also, how wouldn't 
How tanky is Grookey? Like, I'm on level 7, but, like, that's super effective. <laughs> A way that might make this game easier is, like, swapping out your team after every gym to stop them getting overleveled. That might actually make this game a lot easier, or harder. That's another squavit. Squovit? Squavit. I don't really know. I'm gonna call him Squavit. Oh my group, he's a female! That's so rare! Did they? I wonder if they changed the starter percentages to be more likely to be female. Because the starter is like 8-7.5% male all the time, so... I'm so into this. Once I get out of the slumbering weld, I'm gonna wrap up this episode and then probably do another one. I don't know. I want to see what time it is. I can't see what time it is. Uh, I'm going to try and record more episodes tomorrow morning as well. But then I'm in my girlfriend's all weekend. So I'll be able to record it until Sunday night. So this might be a little late going out. But um, it's G. Because I've never once been on time for anything to do with YouTube in my life. So. The music is so good. This is mad. <laughs> This is mad, bro. It's fucking mad, bro. Oh, this is mad. I can't even see my hand in front of my face. Oh, sh oh, Jesus. That was like, what? What in the... <laughs> Grilled. I bet the other one's like, Gward. I also think he looks better without the shield on his face. I'm just going to say that straight out. Oh, whoa. I'll tell you, this definitely is, like, different. This is a new start to a Pokemon game. Run. Oh, I can't run away for some reason. <laughs> the game doesn't even try. It's just like, you can't run away for some reason. It should have been just like, oh, he's too fast. He won't escape. I love that. It's like, you can't get away for some reason. I can't even see the top of Grookey's head. That's funny. Ooh, ah. Are we dead? Oh, I got knocked out. Hop, Rory. <laughs> Your pants with directions. <laughs> Meh. I've seen that meme, actually. It's like the Pokemon community's reaction to Charizard's meh. The little chap is just fine. This will make a pretty fine tale, or page in the tale of my legend. See, he, I like that your rival has goals. The ones in X and Y had no objective other than to follow you around. Postwick. Um, wait, what did he say to do? Fishing rod? Already? Fuck. Um, go tell my mom about an adventure. Also, I have pet Budu. That's cute. I really like Budu. When I'm doing all like playthroughs of this in the future, and I'm using all Pokemon. I'll probably use a Roserade. I really like that Pokemon, but I've never used one. Uh. 
Right. So I have pocket money. Can I go back into the slumbering world? No. Okay. So I assume that's a post-game thing. Well, I've heard this game has no post-game. Well, very little. But like, I don't really give a fuck. Because a lot of the time I just complete the Pokedex and then stop playing. I don't really like... And even then, like, I don't really care. I'm much more into just, like, playing through the game. If there's, po if there's post game content, I'll play it, but usually I don't really care. Like, I didn't care about, like, the Team Rainbow Rocket stuff. And that was meant to be pretty good. Um, wow, the Pokemon. Oh, that's Pokemon Research Lab. I was gonna oh, yeah, Pokemon Center just looks the same. I was gonna say, like, that's hardly the Pokemon Center. Do I have any Pokeballs? Yes, okay, I have five Pokeballs. Right, if I catch Pokemon, it'll get them to fuck off with the tutorial. Rookity. Yeah, go on. I like that you can see the Pokemon in the wild, but the exclamation marks will still pop up if you don't want to. That's a really nice compromise. I want to put Rookity on my team for now. Like, I know Corviknight's really popular, but I really, really like Corviknight. If I see another dark, he's flying steel. If I see another flying or steel type I like more. Like, I do really like Copperaja. Um, but, oh, fuck. Oh, God. That was potent. Uh, go on. Let's get it. Come on, boy. That's it. Rook a D. Right. I completely forgot. Um, I'm going to wrap up this episode here. And then in the next episode, we're going to just keep playing. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, be sure to hit the like button and subscribe for more videos like this one. This message was brought to you by Cine Reacon 473. Stamp sealed and approved. I will see you guys again next time. Peace.